What are you playing <laughs> around with? Come here, buddy. Oh! My stomach! Damn it! See ya. Go poop, Johnny. Hey, Otacon, come where you at, bitch? Okay, here it comes. Hey, I'm here. Where? <laughs> right here. I'm Otacon. Your best yes. friend forever. For life. It's me. Otacon. Wow. They even captured you. Hurry, get me out of here. Let me go. That hurts. Ah. Hurry up. <laughs> Snake, is that how you ask a guy a favor? Let me go. <laughs> Rude. an animal's cage. What a smell. Because yeah, of him. Hi! It's the DARPA chief. If you don't hurry up and get me out of here, I'll be laying next to him. Those bastards. This lock won't open with a security card. You need a key like the soldiers carry. So what are you doing over here, the He's so cute. I, I thought you might be hungry. If you need more food, I can bring some more later. Also, I got you this level six card. It'll get you out of that torture room. Here, take this too. What's this? It's a handkerchief. I got it from Sniper Wolf. Why? I don't know why, but she's nice to me. Sounds like Stockholm Syndrome to me. I was taking care of the dogs here. After the terrorists took over, they were planning to shoot all the dogs. But Sniper Wolf stopped them. She even let me feed them when I asked. She likes dogs. She must be a good person. Please don't hurt her. Wake up, you idiot. She's the one who shot Meryl. Well, that's all I can do. They're planning to launch a nuke. <laughs> I've got to stop them. Here's some food. Then you'll have to get past the communications tower. First, you have to get me out of here. Come on, I'm trying my best. That guard's got the key. You'll have to take him out. Give me a break. I'm no soldier. I can't take anybody out. You have to. I'll be killed. Hmm. He's coming back. Oh, geez. He's coming back. See you later. <laughs> oh, my God. Wait. Yeah, but I get to use. Oh, that's better. See? That looks like I'm dead. Makes me think I'm dead. What the hell? Again, <laughs> same position. <laughs> Good. 
God damn it, I hate when it does that. Falls in. Okay. Well, we can get out now. Yeah, ready. Good, he's torturing me. Torturing me. You bitch. I don't want to smell his poopy poop smell. <laughs> Yay, we're out. That was a long time. See, now we're back here. And now there's cameras. Come on. Come on. Come on. <gasps> I forgot about that. To the communications tower. But first, we're not coming back here. So I feel like I should go upstairs and get everything. You know? Nothing here. Oh, see, I can't get rid of him. Because they're gonna be like, what's your status? Where's your status report? Which they never used to do in the old ones, but in this one they will. What's interesting about the chaff grenades is they never alert them. Why did why did you do that so fast? That's stupid. Huh? Who's there? This is all the stuff I can like interact with now that wasn't here before. Yeah, make a mess. Make a mess, just like NGS2. Come in here. I was in here before. Mine detector, that's the mine detector I needed. <laughs> but now it's kind of unnecessary. Do I have five out of five? Okay, is there still the one under here? Yep. Let me eat these. And I have full life. I can climb up here, but I feel like there's nothing up here, to be honest with you. Still or no? Should we go 
are down here and good in here too, but we can put him to sleep. He's already falling asleep, but just for safety, put him to sleep again. What? What's that? <laughs> okay, we gotta go. I'm sure you can do this. Go, 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 go. Okay, back to the communications tower. We're going back and back and back again. So the cool thing about coming back through this area is now I have this handkerchief. It smells faintly of her that Otacon had received. So, now they'll be nice to me, which is nice. See? They're nice. They're so nice, though. Look at that raggedy tail. Hi, you're nice to me now. You're so scary. Hi, hey, puppies. Hey, puppies. And a baby. What are you doing? You guys are silly. Now we can explore the other side and see if there's anything. See, they're nice now. Nice dogs. They love Snicker Wolf. Snicker Wolf's their mommy. So there's this other hole over here too that I didn't explore earlier because they kept kicking my ass. And there's like a ration or some shit on the other side. Oh, this is different. Alright. Uh, everything. I don't need anything. So that sucks, but I some of that. Cool. Oh, look at him. There's a cute big piece. Baby dogs. Yeah, it's okay. And now we go up to the communication tower. She's not here this time. Oh. Oh, we're gonna have a, like a moment with Meryl's blood stain. out of war. Snake, please, save yourself. It's weird that they had her shoot her under her on, tattoo. In the original, she shoots her in the tattoo. People. Don't forget me. Meryl, you've been so dramatic. You're okay. You're okay. Colonel, shut the fuck up. I'm having a moment. Snake. About Merrill. Colonel, I'm sorry. Listen to me. I... I wasn't able to protect her. Snake, she's a soldier. She knows that prisoners are a part of war. She joined up of her own free will. I'm sure she was prepared for this. No, you're wrong. Merrill thought she had to become a soldier. Thought it was the only way. She said she thought it would bring her closer to her dead father. She said that? She wasn't ready for real combat. I shouldn't have pushed her so hard. It's all my fault. That's not like you, Snake. Master? What is it? Sorry for eavesdropping, but I couldn't just listen anymore. Master? Snake, you can have regrets if you want to. It's only natural. But you can't keep attacking yourself for things that happened in the past. Nothing good will come from that. He's right. Don't kick yourself. It doesn't suit a legend like you. <laughs> I'm sure Meryl's just fine. Mei Ling. Snake, forget about Meryl. Stop Liquid. Forget about Meryl. That's Merrill. what Meryl would want too. <laughs> You're right. Meryl would say the same thing. Snake, 
What? Meryl. She's pretty special to you, huh? She's got well, a good butt. Yeah, special. There aren't many tomboys like her. That's not what I meant. She's the Colonel's niece and a combat buddy. Is that all? Come on. Damn, this guys. Is like a police interrogation. Get alone. No, I just. I guess it's in the genes. The genes? What are you talking about, Colonel? <laughs> no, I just remembered about Naomi's grandfather. I think Naomi said he rose as high as assistant secretary in the FBI during Edgar Hoover's time. Is that right? Yes. Yes. He was Japanese, and he became a special undercover investigator to nab the Mafia. When was that? Your family. Um, sometime in the 50s, I guess. Where? New York, I think. Naomi? I thought that you didn't have any family. I researched it after I became an adult. My grandfather was already dead by the time I learned about him. I never even had the chance to meet him. Oh. Snake. Good luck. Watch your back, Snake. She's starting to get weird. Spoiler alert. Meryl is actually the Colonel's daughter. Boom! Just drop that on you real quick. I'm already full of everything, so I don't think I need to go in the cubby holes anymore. My nose is itching like a mother fucker. Let's see what that box is, though. Oh, I did. I did need that. Thank you. Yeah, okay. There we go. That <laughs> seems normal. Alright, let's get this, and let's get this, because we're gonna have a shitload of guys to kill. And, uh, we're gonna- Oh. That's not where that happens in the no regular game. In the original, it happens right after the snow battle before the blast furnace. Interesting.